Police are quickly approaching and one popular organization in the Roanoke Valley needs your assistance to help those in need. Volunteers at the Roanoke Rescue Mission have a new program that feeds people weekly. WSLS 10's Duke Carter spoke with volunteers at the Rescue Mission today. So Duke, how long will the, will the food they currently have last? Well, volunteers say the food that they have will last for about another week, and that's why they're in desperate need of donations. It's a busy day at the Roanoke Rescue Mission. Second, uh, Workers are filling dozens of boxes. Been giving out about 145 boxes a week. With canned goods for families who are in need. That is probably more than 17, 1,700 cans of food a week. Tracy Altizer is the director of development at the Roanoke Rescue Mission. She says the mission has taken on a new program called Mana Mission Ministry. It came about after Mana Ministries closed its doors in Vinton earlier this year. Took it on in April. So to be able to do this outreach to the broader community is so important because many of these families are teetering on the brink of homelessness, and this is a way to keep them from ending up needing our shelter services. Altizer says the program is working well, serving about 1,500 families a month. But with the cold weather approaching, Altizer says the need will rise. But those numbers are going to increase to about 200 boxes a week, which will be the equivalent of about 2,400 cans of food each week. Altizer says the mission relies on donations from local organizations and churches to help fill the need. And that's why she's calling out for help. Confident that by getting the word out that we have this need to support hungry people in our community that people will respond because that's just what they do here. Now food donations can be dropped off at the rescue mission.